Yes, my favorite family is back. This is going to be some recap, of course. I didn't realize how much I needed the show until I saw it was coming back. I need a little bit of no upset in my life. We got ourselves a wife. We got ourselves a kid. Best kid. All that's left is the dog. <laughs> I've been waiting months for the dog episode. Yes, and it was all very elegant. An assassin, yep. Best girl, and also a telepath. Oh, new opening! Hell yeah! Looks beautiful. Different style than the first one. The singing sounds really familiar, too. <gasps> Look at him, he's so cute! Can't wait. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> he's just riding in the car. Like a person. I guess we gotta get ourselves a car, too. I miss my dog. And birds! Bird heart! Oh yeah, oh yeah, also there's, there's death. <laughs> also, it's an international cold war that's high stakes. It's not all just love and family. You forget, you know? <laughs> you, you, you get so heartwarmed that you forget that this is... There's a lot going on. A lot of dangerous stuff. Dark stuff. This is definitely a show where Kingdom Hearts is light, though. You know they're bad because they're mistreating animals. Project Apple, Mission 13. Dog day, dog day. Probably. <laughs> That'll be easy. Let's just forget about the war for a bit. Let's just enjoy getting ourselves a pet. How are you going to top dog, though, for the second Stella? They all have their different charms. I think we're looking for something a little bit more fluffy. No, but this is Spyak's family. The dog needs to have a sympathetic backstory. Way to discriminate, Anya. All dogs deserve a chance. Kind of like the Doberman, he's got a lot of personality. He reminds me of myself. <laughs> yeah, an international meeting of leaders during a Cold War, what could go wrong? Just don't get in, in any helicopters or airships or whatever it was in Gundam. Way to say his name. Great leadership. That's a buyer's market, as I said in Breaking Bad. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's... How did I... How do I... When am I gonna stop falling for disguises on this channel? First it was Envy. Now Lloyd. There it is. There's the connection. That is just evil on so many levels. I mean, the Prime Minister assassination is whatever, but the dogs. This is probably the most evil plan I've ever seen in anime. One thing I think about a lot is I've had a lot of pets over the years, or a couple pets over the years. I've had two dogs in my life, and both of them are rescues. And you know right away that they've been housebroken, or that they've had families and i've had really good luck in the sense that the dogs i've had and also this this guy over here this cat who's also a rescue are just exceptional and like just have great personalities and are super cool and chill i wonder what was it that led people to discard them was it just logistical issues i wonder if maybe it isn't unrealistic expectations of what it means to have a pet maybe it's just because i grew up with pets from a young age that they feel like family or maybe it's that i'm infected with like cat parasites because that's a thing <laughs> is there a word for bomb dogs in japanese <laughs> I mean, or they just could know how to do it, if someone has expertise. Yeah, if it really is a third power, it might be a success either way, just to sow the seeds of discord. There he is! Hopefully I adopt both, though the one on the right wasn't in the intro. He's so cute, he's like a polar bear. <laughs> there he is, just behaving himself. Oh, he saved him! He did, he's a good boy. Morph. <laughs> the dog has a heart of gold. 
Keith seems like a really great guy. A charming fellow all around. Your heart just aches. Rabbits kind of scare me, actually. I'm a rabbit zodiac, but I've had friends with rabbit pets and I always get bit. They bite real hard. Oh, she just fished for compliments real hard and got nothing out of it. Love at first sight. What if they're both psychics? <laughs> I wonder if Anya can read the dog's mind. She can! That is going to be such a special bond. No, Anya has already decided. Right, right. Let's just go into this warehouse. The way this is going, Yor might disrupt this whole terrorist plot by accident. Borf. Oh no, he's sad. <laughs> yes, correct. <laughs> Maybe the dog. The dog? The dog or your? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> that bark sounded great. <laughs> That's so great. I think you just ride him out of there. Oh, he's scared. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And she's wanted up before, right? Focus, your focus. Just go outside and look. Project Apple. Project Apple. This is very Cowboy Bebop. Did they just formulate a plan together? Did Anya and the dog just formulate an escape plan? How did he know that? Did he just make that happen? <laughs> I knew that was going to happen at some point. It was his destiny she was going to be riding him. Yeah, that's my question. Did you hear the electricity? What? That is such an incredible and cute asset. <laughs> Imagine. Anya disappears for 30 minutes and then you just see her riding this polar bear. That is so Anya. How much do they pay on like warehouse rental deposits in a month? They're students, so they're definitely being funded by a third party. <laughs> exactly. Waku Waku. We're back. Anya's just totally forgotten about your. <laughs> I don't know if you could earn... You can, you can earn Stellas for normal civilian stuff. Borf indeed. <laughs> Sound effect is so great. Wait, what? He can see the future, but not the way to go. Oh no, I had high hopes for you, German Shepherd. Your. 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 These guys are dead. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, yours looked all terrifying. This is just written a whole narrative. <laughs> I mean, whatever. Whatever makes this ass kicking happen, I'm fine with it. Oh, that's it? And new ending! You definitely like up the, the colors, the saturation for these new openings and endings. But kept the family heart. The picture is, is absent. Where did it go wrong? I guess you were teaching her how to cook. It looks so good, it's not even fair. Yeah, just a normal family meal. That's how everyone eats. How do they found, find time to sit down for dinner? I wonder, like, how long the story will span and if Anya will grow up at all. 
I hadn't considered that. So that was a really fun return to the show. It's hard to explain or understand why this show makes me feel as good as it does. Like, I don't know, I just can't watch the show and not be happy. The dog, even though it's just the introduction of his character. It's such a great addition. It's it's one of those things where you don't realize how much you needed it until it's there. The family feels complete. Although I wouldn't be upset if they also got themselves a cat. A cat that has the power of time travel, weather manipulation, adamantium skeleton. It's also a cool and very fitting choice to have the dog have a, you know, a significant and relevant backstory. Not that the buff Doberman wasn't cool. I felt like he had a lot of personality as well, but it's just cool in general to have an origin. And it fits really well with the, the existing families since, you know, they all have their individual, very interesting histories and powers, motivations. Although we still haven't gotten Anya's yet, really. We just have gotten glimpses of it. It makes the, the ensemble feel richer and more complementary to each other, if that makes sense. I'm getting the sense from just this first episode in the second half of season one, that with a lot of the elements in place, we're gonna to start to see longer arcs maybe. This seems like it's going to be a couple episodes at least. There's just so much to do. I mean, just the way it's been set up, the richest of the characters, the stakes on the world stage, them having secrets from the world and also each other, Anya growing up and the whole school saga, Damien. I don't know how long the manga is, but there's just such a rich world that's been created. I feel like this show could sustain this quality and this level of fun for a really long time. So I can't wait to get to episode 14 and 15, which is already out. I'm kind of late watching this. But yeah, see you very soon for the conclusion, maybe, of this arc of the most evil anime villains of all time.